The Invisible Rulers Conference, three mystic creatures of the heavenly realms. God has granted the bond servant of Christ John access to this revelation for the preceding days of the emerging age of the sons of God. There are ministers whose job is not necessary to preach. They are watchers. They are gatekeepers of realms. They, 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 they are spiritual combat. I mean, spiritual militants, spiritual warriors who stand in the realms of the spirit to object the influence of principalities, powers, rulers of darkness, and spiritual wickedness in the heavenly places. So when this man roar, it's not about here. They are men of dimensions, reign of men of realms. In the spirit, they are act ministers. Do you understand that men of God are angels? And in the ranking of angels, you have act angels. Are you hearing me now? You have the angels. There are Michael, you know, that is he's a prince angel. He has a certain level of powers. In the human version, there are archangels in the realms. They are gatekeepers of this gate of, of the earthly realms where Satan can influence, order, and manipulate the destiny of humanity. There could be a man of God who may not preach well, who may not quote the Bible as one that has read it. Who may not preach like some men of God, but they are principalities, they are watchers. But you know, they in the realms they carry a certain vibrations in the spirit that filters vibrations that filter vibrations that attack object hinder the prowess the influence and dominance of darkness in our world because very soon some of you will start to identify who you are there are some of you you've prayed but your ministry isn't growing as you want it but when you pray you don't know why there is an energy that you can't explain. There are some of you here, when you want to preach, you can't preach well. You're not happy. But when you, when you just say, Father, you are there for five hours. You can't explain what is it. But because you are, you are told that if you are a minister, you must have an order. Who has lied to you? Do you know that they that uphold the atmosphere of the body of Christ are people that have the gift and the call of intercession? Do you know that any ministry that don't have intercessors will fall? Because intercessors are those who uphold the spiritual atmosphere of every given ministry. The Bible says, when the watchers of the kingdom slept satan had access into the fertile ground of the kingdom and sowed pears now in the original plan of zion the pears was not supposed to be sown but jesus says why the watchmen slept why the watchmen not the church not the saved why the watchers? Why the watchers went to the pulpit preaching? Why the watchers became pastors? Why the watchers became teachers? Why the watchers became entrepreneurs? Why the watchers became businessmen and businesswomen? 
Satan had access into that dimension that controls the future of the church. Why the gatekeepers? Like, oh, hello? Gatekeepers in the realms. Forget about this physical realm. Here is a function of the doors that we have opened in the realms. The forces that we have opened to come into this place. That's what controls this entire realm. Be careful, your family has a gate. Your children has a gate. Your life has a gate. Your body has a gate. Your marriage has a gate. There has to be a gatekeeper of your marriage. You're a gate to your children. You're a watchman. You're a watchwoman keeping watch over the spiritual atmosphere of your family. The problem is that we have not yet identified watchers amongst the Christendom. So most watchers are preaching. So the move of God is not gated. The influence of the spirit of a nations are not gated and fortified because ministry has been misguided because everybody wants to have a pulpit so the watchers are sleeping because the moment you have left your divine positioning you cannot dispose it takes discovering your assignment to be in the right disposition do you know the particular elohims that slept where the daughters of men were watchers. God kept them, kept them in the position as watchers over man. Man. They, they were in that realm to watch over men. And they looked while watching. They lusted and had affection for the daughters of men. The sin of watchers. The sin of watchers keeps they that are under your watch vulnerable you don't put weak sexually driven carnal men as watchmen before you you don't put men who are controlled by flesh as watchmen of this ministry no no now you know why i am tough you know why i'm tough I don't hate you, I love you. But once you become a leader, you're a watchman. You're a door into this ministry. Many, many ministries have fallen. Many ministries have gone through terrible experience because they made weak men watch us. Samahira, Samahira. Get the Invisible Rulers Conference DVD on Pastor John's Digital Library to learn more about angels, rebel gods, invisible rulers, and the invisible nations over visible nations. www.pastorjohndigitalmedia.com Messages available on MP3 and MP4 formats. Don't be deceived by the limitations of the human eye. Get a copy of these messages and receive capacity to see beyond. For further details and more teaching email, info at pastorjohndigitalmedia.com. WhatsApp, plus 2763-423-5895.